Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to this 100% walkthrough of Assassin's Creed. Today, we're going to be gathering all of the intel on our next target, who is William of Montferrat. He's our target here in the rich district of Arca, and I've been, as usual, off camera, collecting up all the viewpoints, saving all the citizens. So we've got six parts of our investigation to do today, and we're going to kick it off with this informer right here. Oh God, don't kill me! Oh, it's you, Altair. You scared me. Richard's men are after me. Two of them, to be exact. I was trying to strike a deal with them, but I realized that they were toying with me, so I ran away. You shall be the angel of death and collect their heads before they collect mine. When it is done, I shall tell you of the deal. Seriously, how the hell did he mistake us for whoever's after him? <laughs> it's so obvious we're an assassin. Be interested to see what these tar- right, okay, so this is the target. How on earth did he mistake this guy for us? <coughs> I honestly don't know. Anyway, that's one down. Stop trying to grab me, people. Oh, they're so annoying. If I remember right, they took those sort of punchy people out of Assassin's Creed 2. Which I'm quite happy about, I'll be honest, because they have been very irritating so far in this playthrough. Um, but yeah. I mean, I can see what they were doing with it, why they created them. We might have to climb over here, actually. Uh, yep, yeah, we can get up here, nice. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, a, it's an interactive member of society, isn't it, I guess. But I'm not a huge fan of them, <laughs> as you can probably tell by now. Uh, we want to get down from here before this guy gets angry with us, so let's do that. Right, you shouldn't be angry with us anymore, dude. This guy should be here. Yes, he is. Hello, goodbye. And then that guy is just going to smack us for some reason. Nothing to see around there, fellas. Wouldn't worry about it if I were you. So let's head back to the informer and get our intel, shall we? What a relief it is to know that I am safe. Thank you, master. I tried to make a deal with the Citadel guards to leave the gates open, even when the alarm sounds. I failed you. So now, your only escape from Richard's Citadel will be to climb the fortress walls. Forgive me. Aha! Interesting. So if the gates close, we can climb the walls to get out of the citadel. So that will be coming in useful because the gates will be closing. So what else have we got? We've got three pickpocket missions, an interrogation mission, and another informer. So let's head over to this pickpocket mission. If you're new to this walkthrough, the pickpocket missions are probably the one that I dislike the most. Um, I'm not very good at them, that's why. They're not particularly bad, I just don't have the highest success rate with them <laughs> which I know some of you guys enjoy because uh, you like seeing me fail on stuff which is fair enough so let's get over to this anyway we'll pickpocket this person hopefully on the first attempt actually over by the shore here look at this perhaps it was unwise to embrace William he is old and thinks too much of himself his army is the largest beyond the Osinon. We'll have need of them. For now, I'll go and visit with the other brothers. Make sure they have everything they need. Aye, they must not fall. Fear not, the Master has a plan. Even now, he prepares a way to turn our losses to his advantage, should it come to that. What does he intend? The less you know, the better. Just do as you've been instructed. Deliver the letter you carry to our Master. So that is a Templar, and I don't really remember that being a thing, but apparently there are Templars who aren't hostile towards us. Anyway, let's steal this, shall we? So, another man in the harbour seems connected to William. Not the best intel, I suppose, but it'll do. So let's head over to this next pickpocket mission. Hopefully this one will give us a bit more information sorry about your pots everybody but you know we haven't got time for all that nonsense <laughs> oh that's the guy there look <laughs> he's walking away <laughs> little does he know we've just stolen that letter from that person right where's the next one here 
What news? Grim, I finished my scout. A direct assault won't work. What's the trouble? Archers. He's got them all over the fortress. And no easy way to reach them. They'd pick us off before we'd made it ten feet inside. You've kept a record, yes? Aye. I've marked their positions on a map. Bring it to the others. No doubt they'll have a use for it. Very well. I'll go at once. Stay strong, brother. Yes. And you. So I honestly can't remember if the guards react to you pickpocketing people in this game. I don't think they do, but I'm not 100% on that. Anyway, we'll take that. Thank you, old man. So we've acquired a map which holds the position of William's archers. No, that guard literally saw me do that, so and he doesn't seem bothered in the slightest. So let's uh, let's over to head over to this one next. We'll do the last pickpocket mission because I want to get them out of the way, if I'm completely honest. So we'll get that one out of the way and done. Uh, let's take a shortcut over the roofs, shall we? I might regret this if there's a guard up here, but hopefully there isn't. No, it doesn't look like it. Uh, right, we'll go this way. And we can run straight here. And while we're having a bit of a lull in this, I will just announce as well that starting, well, it will be tomorrow from when this video goes out, um, I will finally have a Patreon account, because I know some of you guys have been asking me to create one for quite some time, uh, and I haven't done it yet, but now I have got one. It's launched on the 1st of Feb, so you guys will be able to go and become a patron if you want to do that. Um, it will cost £3 per month, or whatever the equivalent is in your currency, and for that you'll get instant access to all of my videos so as soon as I've recorded and uploaded it to YouTube you can watch it on an unlisted playlist just for patrons so you won't have to wait for the schedule you also get unedited versions of the GTA videos without all the bits that I've cut out and you will also be helping out charity because 20% of everything I make goes to charity as well. So, where the hell is this pickpocket thing? That's interesting. I was pretty sure it should be at the bottom of that wall, but it doesn't appear to be there. So, unless it's on the other side of the wall, maybe? In here, which is possible. This place is restricted. Be gone. Sharp. <laughs> yep, here they are. They let you come and go as you please. I thought the fortress was closed to all. Aye, but William wishes to have repairs completed as soon as possible. It's been to our advantage. The perfect cover. It's clever. Anyway, I've finished my report and should deliver it. For once, it seems things might go our way, and not by accident. Well, the Bible does say God helps those who help themselves. Nah, it doesn't, actually. That's from one of Aesop's fables. The Bible says quite the opposite, in fact. Many passages of being patient and faithful are waiting for the Lord to decide if he wishes to assist. Well, I say we've waited long enough. You'll hear no argument from me. Very well. I'm off, then. Talking about Aesop's fables and the Bible and all sorts. Nothing suspicious here, mate. Just keep walking. And I'll take that from you. A forgotten structure can pose as a potential entrance. We'll have to remember that one. I mean, I pretty much remember the way anyway, to be honest. Uh, yeah, that's mildly annoying that those guys are there. We'll have to climb over. But yeah, as I was saying, Patreon, if you want to become a patron, go ahead to patreon.com slash Turian Shepherd and you can join up on there. Come no and get early access to all the videos, get unedited GTA stuff, and help support two charities, which the channel supports as well. So you can go ahead and do that if you want. I'll also be launching a merch store later in the year as well because I've had a couple of requests for that too. Um, I'm just working on some designs and things for that at the moment. So plenty of exciting things coming 
in the future. So we let's head up rat. here to this interrogation. To end our pain. Ah! It's him we should follow. Sorry, mate. <laughs> it's him will lead us to victory. Um, Too close. Okay, we'll back off a bit. It's all way to end our pain. It's him we should follow. It's him will lead us to victory. Stand up, friends. Do not allow yourself to be set to slaughter based on the whims and wishes of an uncertain king. We must rely on men who are stronger in their convictions. Men like William of Montferrat! Alright, let's follow him. And when he gets to somewhere out of sight, we will make our move. Where are you going, buddy? Somewhere quiet? I mean, you really need to. Maybe go down that little alleyway, which is just up here. Or is there an alleyway? I can't actually see. <laughs> Hopefully he's going to go down a quiet little alleyway somewhere. Uh, is there a quiet little alleyway along here? I thought there was. Yeah, I think there's... Maybe not. Do we just attack him out here? I mean, that would be pretty bold. Also, there's a guard here, so I don't really want to do that. Maybe he's going to go somewhere quiet in a second. I mean, I could probably just attack him here, to be fair. I mean, the guard might not like this, but... No, the guard's just going to let us fight, apparently. I mean, I don't, I don't know how the guard's going to react to the fact that we're going to kill him in a second, but... <laughs> Oi! What is it you want? Gold? I have a few pieces on me. Take them. Take them and go. It's not gold I see, but information. I know nothing. You know William. Tell me how to reach him. It's impossible. He meets at the king. And when will the king be gone? Today. But it won't help you. It's sure to argue. And then William will retire to lecture the soldiers. So it always goes. Richard berates William. William berates his men. He won't see you. I already told you. I need to see William. But I never said he needs to see me. Then our business is done. Not yet, I'm afraid. There's one last thing I need from you. What is it? How is this going to work? It is only a matter of time. Oh, he's just going to stand there and get stabbed, okay? Well, yeah, in you know plain daylight, fair enough. William will be distracted today by Richard's visit, so that's something to bear in mind. One more to go. It's an informer. So I imagine this is probably going to be flags given how the other ones went, but maybe not. So, let's head... I think it's in the Citadel, which could be a problem, because that's a pretty hostile area for assassins, funnily enough. If it is inside... Yeah, it is. Damn. Yeah, so, my experience from here, during the viewpoints and things like that, is they do not like it if you go inside the Citadel there through that portcullis. So, I'm hoping... This guy is not going to send us in there. But let's see. Back again, Altair. Always in need of a hand to do your dirty work. This time, Al Muelim did not order anything. It is just for my own pleasure that I ask you to find some Masia flags I've hidden in Richard's district. Since I am a loyal assassin unlike others, I will tell you what people are saying in Akka. It is important information. But this time, try to come back to me faster than the first time. Well, you know, I think that's a bit ridiculous, mate. That, uh, that really Given that they're your flags and you're supposed to be collecting them, you can't really make demands like that, can you? <laughs> Come back to me faster than last time. Who does he think he is? When is he gonna stop this Pretty sure I outrank him. No, Even please, with the demotions that we had God. earlier in the game. <laughs> Pretty sure we outrank him, so... He's got some nerve, hasn't he? Uh, it's kind of annoying there's a guard there. We'll just sort of ignore him, shall we? Let me be on my way, guard, and I'll let you be on yours. 
Right. Uh, what are we up to now? I mean, we've nearly done it, to be honest. I mean, we probably are going to do it qu quicker than last time, to be fair. So what do you say to that? Your hard work is changing my opinion of you. Here is what I know about William of Montferrat. He and Richard had a disagreement before the king left for Jaffa. Since then, William stays in his citadel, surrounded by his army. Do you have what it takes to attack him in this protected environment? We'll see, but I am still doubtful. Now, you can be doubtful all you want, but we certainly will. Right, William will retreat to the back of his citadel when challenged by King Richard. So, that means in there. But we'll get in there, and we'll take him out, even though he's surrounded by all these guys. We know what we're doing. But that is going to do it for this episode, guys. So as always, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click on that like button. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell if you're new, or just haven't already done so. And I'll see you all next time.